Meet Warwickshire's youngest paleontologist, eight-year-old Harish. you carry this carry it right here into the middle hey very very nice to meet you Thank come you. and sit down nice what on earth have you brought out here i've brought lots of my toy dinosaurs how many do you think you've got in there i've got about 25 but i have over 300 dinosaurs at home do you yes now you seem like a very smart guy and i would like to play this game lucky dinosaur dip are you up for that? Yes. I put my hand in there and pull something out. You will tell me some facts about that dinosaur, okay. will you? OK. OK, here goes. What was that? There isn't a dinosaur here, is there? You would tell me if you saw one, wouldn't you? No. Nope. Please don't let me. I yes. think we're safe. I think we're generally quite safe. Close your eyes. Mm hmm OK. I'm quite tempted to just tiptoe off now, but I won't. <laughs> There's that noise again! <laughs> right. What is that? That is a Styracosaurus. Right. It was a Ceratopsian, a group of dinosaurs with beaks as mouths. It was a herbivorous dinosaur that lived in the Cretaceous period. What do you think that dinosaur smelt like? I'm not sure. Did you say it was a herbivore? Yes. Yes, yeah, so it would have had quite nice breath, probably. The ones that are the carnivores, you know, if they ate humans and then they burped... <laughs> ooh, that wouldn't smell very nice, would it, at all? Right, I'm going in very quickly now. OK. Ready? Go. <laughs> what is that? That is a Pachycephalosaurus. <laughs> It was a herbivorous dinosaur that lived in the Cretaceous period. The name Pachycephalosaurus means thick-headed lizard because of how hard it's head is. It was used for ramming predators and ramming other Pachycephalosauruses. May I just demonstrate? Do you mean like this? Yes. Right, OK, yeah. <laughs> Rex, my yes. favourite dinosaur. The name Tyrannosaurus Rex means tyrant king lizard. It was a carnivorous dinosaur that lived in the Cretaceous period. It was from North America with the brain size of an orange and the teeth size of bananas. <laughs> Is there any you want to show us? Yes. Which one? <laughs> Oh, look at this. This has a movable bottom jaw. That is a velociraptor. You know, I've just had a thought while we're sitting here. Imagine if a tiny little egg of a dinosaur got trapped in a little bit of amber and then one day somebody melted the amber and grew the egg and there was like an island in the middle of nowhere where suddenly all the dinosaurs were coming back to life again. What do you think about that idea? Do you think I could sell it as a film idea? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Subscribe to watch the latest videos. Visit the Little Big Shots channel to watch more.